All right, Gabriel. You want to show everybody your, your Becca? Now, we did get something in here that's going to be a fifth grade item. So, so Gabriel's been doing the Abeka Kindergarten Academy. And I have to do like six more lessons and then I'm in first grade. You have to do six more lessons to hit lesson 100. And then, <clears throat> okay, so that's going to be for Nora. The spelling grade five. Here, I'll take the box for me. So. This is probably for Audrey. And that's for you. Wait, what? There you go. You can put that. Can you put that on the desk, Gabriel? Okay. It's so let's just. Turn the pages. Okay. So we're going to explain. Gabriel's doing the kindergarten. We started off just doing parent led. Yeah. And. and go ahead. And it says A. C A D E M Y. So basically, um, it was more convenient for me to just put on a video for him. And he's been doing the Abeka Phonics and he's been doing really well, right, Gabriel? Yeah, I know how to like spell well now. Yeah, so basically, um, he's at lesson 100, but we're going to try to get him through the phonics in. Uh, a couple of weeks and to be done his phonics and so my goal is i just want to get him reading really well and he can still work on math from kindergarten writing i like everything mm -hmm. and we don't care so much about like the other videos they have we just we just don't really care about that our biggest focus is like bible writing reading and math right gabriel yeah but mom what did the lady say when i was jumped out of the closet uh Supplies. Oh, supplies. Because uh, supplies, like, supplies the white queen. Yep. Okay, you want to show them your books, Gabriel? Yep. So we're going to start him. Once he's done the phonics, he's going to merge into this. Ooh, that's so nice. Wow. Mm-hmm. Cursive. And this one's manuscript. I like I like cursive. Mm -hmm. This will probably be for Audrey or Nora. Nope, that's for you. Those are two books, Gabriel. Those are two books. And then here's the Rebecca Phonics video title. Wait, yep. wait, this is for Olivia because she's doing it. Well, Olivia, we don't we don't know what she watch. She'll come in and like sit for a second and watch some of Gabriel's videos, and then she'll be like ah ba 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 ba, and she'll be like kind of engaged, but not. She'll she'll leave you know real quick, and then the other day she sat through and watched a lesson for twenty minutes, and I was like, Good Lord, you're you're three years old, which I'm not trying to push that. I promise you, I'm the kind of person that doesn't advocate little kids but, doing but if intense you watch work. Your little kids don't work you need to go to read you need to go on this because it's mm -hmm. really good to read yeah so the reason i bought this is because i expect prices to go up so i thought i might as well just get this while it's like 20 bucks yeah, or whatever my my this is what you're currently doing the abeka yeah yes what i'm doing Okay, so you want to show them the insides of your book, Gabriel? Yay! All right, let's let's do it. It's my book right here. Well, that that's your book. We're just okay. It's gonna be Olivia's. And you like a Becca? Yeah. What do you think about it? Yeah, and I can tell my mom what this is. It's n e neck and can k wait k can. Mop, map, wog, wag. Good job, Gabriel. He's going to be learning four-letter words soon. They're just in the lessons where they're getting to their reading sentences. Wet, web, neck, ham, wait. Ham. 
bus. Red. <laughs> Red. Good job. Okay. So well, I have another video flip through of this. I'll just kind of just do a brief just to show you because that's what these videos are about, just to kind of give you an idea. This is something you can just do yourself or you can buy their videos or you can buy their kindergarten, like parent-led thing. Like, can I already know how to like read a like, uh, five-letter word? Mm -hmm. And the way they start their, their phonics is they teach you the five vowels and it the short vowel sound. So, a, 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 a. Then they do blends like ba 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 ka 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 ka. Like well, consonants. Consonant and blends. Blends are like blends is about. It's basically like a a and a t stuck together, and that's a blend. Mhm. Mm so basically, they teach you short vowel sounds, consonants, blends. Then they go into three letter words with the short vowel sound. Then they start teaching you sentences, and then they teach you four-letter words with two vowels, and where it's the long vowel sound. And then now in this video, how good we're learning, we can read, like, a 15-letter word. Mm -hmm. How good we're learning. Yep. Okay, so you want to show them your other books here, Gabriel? Mm. These are the ones that you're going to have. Go no, no, so these, these new ones. Your... No, your new ones, Gabriel. Okay. You want to show everybody what it looks like inside? And with a Becca, yeah. boy, with a Becca, their kindergarten, first grade, and second grade all follow the exact same phonics charts from their handbook for reading. So if you don't want to spend a lot of money on stuff, just get the handbook for reading. And it literally is like the whole playbook. I know how to spell this. C C K wait K A K. K mm -hmm. yes. And all the, the things they teach in this spelling lines up with what they're learning at the same time in their phonics book. So everything goes on the same path pit, together. Pit, 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 pit. So where they're teaching a and pray, that's going to line up with the phonics book for the same, like, week they're doing these words. Mm. Cross. Good job. All right, you want to show them another book? I'll just, I'll just show them what it looks like in the back. Okay, can I take these out? Um, you can just do one book at a time. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready, Mommy. Come here, we don't need this. Come on. Okay. How about that little box? I'm doing this right now. Oh, okay. He's like, I got this. A, B, C, D, F. You want to show them the pages in here? Yeah. So, sorry. They show, you start at the beginning there, and then you... You work. start at the red dot. Yeah, and they show you right up, up here, too. And then you go like that, that, that. Mm -hmm. And then whenever they show this in these kind of lessons, it means that they're right here. Mm-hmm. And then... Looks like there's numbers on the back. The take three four minutes. and I, I've talked about pen time we do like pen time as well but um I kind of just go back and forth we're on lesson five six seven and if you have an older child I don't think there's anything wrong with them starting on kindergarten or grade one Eagle. manuscript or cursive yeah. there's A nothing wrong with it some of my kids have had some sloppy writing, like Nora and Audrey, and I've said, if you keep up with that sloppy writing, we're going to start right back at the beginning, and then they start to correct it a bit, but I'm like, that's okay, we're just going to get you right back on grade one, or this or that, and then they start to do better. Oh, All right, oh, let's go a little faster. We don't have to go through 
like work oh. like page by page. He goes like, T. And then here's where they're doing two and then three. So they're they're doing the sound, the, the blend, and then but, the word. But two is a sight word. And sorry, I have allergies, so if I sound a little stuffly, stuffy, it's because it's, it's just that time of year. So I purchased this early because I want to just progress Gabriel with his reading. He can still take his time in kindergarten doing the cursive and the write or the, you know, math. And he does have BJU math grade one as well. But I just figured I want the reading to be a thing that takes off because if he can read, he can teach himself all kinds of things. I mean, all of our children should learn how to read. I mean, reading is so important, isn't it, Gabriel? What if you get lost and you need to look at a sign to figure out how to go where you got to go? I don't really know how to read because they don't know how to read. But what if what if I've been in there too long so I didn't know how to read? Well, you're going to you're going to be continuing reading, so you're going to be just fine. So reading is a big, big thing for us. Um, <clears throat> Audrey didn't like the kindergarten videos as much. I the love them. Yeah, he loves them. You kind of at first liked it, then you kind of started to not like it, and then you went back into liking it again. You kind of had like a little hesitation, and then you Here kind of got go. into it. You're on page 100. But Audrey, she didn't do that well with the Abeka Academy in the kindergarten level. She really just didn't enjoy it and then we had to go over certain things over and over do not do not get abc mouse and i ended up having to change things up for audrey we slowed down a bit i also bought another phonics book to kind of just start over in certain areas because she when they started to really take off she was like this is too fast i don't like it so we kind of just slowed down and, you know some of that could have been my fault who knows hang on Gabriel. let me just let me just show them what this looks like and then we'll be done with this book Oh, we're that was my first child teaching the reading. So Nora, we started homeschooling when she was in second grade. So Nora already knew how to read. So, um, so basically, like Audrey was my first to to read that we taught. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you okay? I was like, don't start crying. Oh gosh, that'd be really bad. Okay, so this is just identical. It's just cursive. It's the, Sorry if the camera's a little It's jumpy. like the same thing as this. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to do a quick flip through just so you kind of... They don't even know this because we only told the one here. It's. I think it's just identical. It's just cursive. It's like okay. identical. And I probably have another video about it too. Okay, so this is the main phonics right here. Letters and sounds. This is the phonics book. Egg, egg, um, egg is... Well, E, 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 um, E, G, G, egg. I kind of like holding this. And I have some other videos too, so if you want to see the other videos. Yeah, teach them all your videos. Like, well, I think Olivia doesn't need to do that one question because she doesn't know how to count. He's like, one, two, three, seven. Okay, so this was saying, circle the blend you hear at the beginning of the word, and then write the five vowels, and then Mom, there's I, matching the blend with the word over there. Mom, can, mm -hmm. I, can, I do, can I, like, write down the pencil while I'm, like, skipping through this? Okay, let well, me, let no, me Gabriel, we're, you still have to finish your kindergarten. This is just, like... <clears throat> You'll probably be doing this in a couple weeks as long as you, you know, power through your lessons. But, Mom, I want to do it right now. I know you're excited. I'm glad that you're excited. Give me the book. Give okay, so that's that. And then this one is more like the English focus. I, I'm flipping okay, for it. Okay, go ahead. You do it, okay. So this is more like, you know, sentences, you know, put a period at the end of a sentence, do a capital letter. It's it's still some phonics, of course, but it's it's getting them ready for basically like English. Let's go slower so they can see what it says, okay? So we have but see you're still you're still doing phonics. Don't touch it, guy. Jan likes the trick. Jan can eat a big cone. 
the red bug is on the tree, the red bug is on the leaf. So here, see how this is, write each sentence correctly, remember the capital letter. What? So they're just learning how to, you know, do sentences. He had a big bone. And your child can write in cursive or manuscript right there. And it's nice because uh, it's helping them, you know, they have the proper boxes I here to try to. Corn. That's good. Um, K-O-N. Corn. Like to the feet. So I hope this kind of gives you guys an idea. We did not buy the math because Gabriel actually has the BJU math from kindergarten that he's still working on and then he has the bju math in the videos of bju math so he doesn't really need the math you are wild this time. man all right so guys i hope this has kind of helped you oh gabriel we got to open up the grade five spelling i'm not fucking through wait wait not. i want to sell them to i want to sell them can you cut this open for me like there's yes. a starting point in here maybe i don't know to cut these like circles. Do you want me to start it and then you finish it? No. Usually you poke a hole <clears throat> and then you put the scissors in the hole. So like I would start right in this point. Where there's like a gap so use the sharper side of the scissors turn it around the other way there you go um open it up open it up and slice it so um op open these up use that part right there to cut a line <laughs> good job see you did it okay see now you can put it in there and cut it Cut Nora's book. <laughs> Part of the reason I bought this was I like how Becca's spelling words are pretty advanced. And this is a book that you can reuse. Um, you can just reuse it for kid after like, kid. And I think they're going to upgrade this if I had to guess. Like, okay. yeah? But like, if you're trying to do it, I'm just going to put this down. There we go. If you're gonna do it, do not, if you're like gonna like do all the things like that, do not do it. Tell them like, be with them and be like, what's this word? And then they circle it for the hand, but not with the pencil. Oh. And then the Your other, hands. and then <laughs> they, and then um, you circle it right there with the next kid. And then with the very, very last kid, you can start circling off the pen. Mm-hmm. So, um, I might do a flip through of this. Usually I do flip throughs of things. Uh, that cough. But I just thought, we have the grade four of this, and I just thought, I like how Abeka's spelling words are kind of challenging. And, and I read it this one, and I was like, I read it this one, and I was like, five. I was like, you know, count on One, two, three, four, five, six, nine hundred. All right, well, we are done. Are you excited to? Yes, I'm excited to go now and go with my babysitter. Okay, well, we'll see you guys later. Bye.